On this sunny day, the community of Maloko, near Lungi in Sierra Leone, celebrate the opening of the St. John of God Catholic Community Health Center. This is set up in cooperation with the Hospital Brothers from Holland. We feel good. We gather glad in this day for all the COVID hospitals. During the 1990s Civil War, rebels attacked the previous hospital of the Hospital Brothers in Lunsa, further inland. This caused the brothers to flee to the coastal area of Lungi. After two years, the brothers decided to also settle here because the local people are still in deep need of health care. This clinic was constructed as a result of the expressed need that was made by the people of my Kafubulom chiefdom. Some time ago, during the war, we were here as displaced people and we rendered some few services to the community people. They were impressed, they were happy with our services. And when the war ended, they asked us to permanently stay in this community. Because looking at our service in Lusa, in my Bensene community, they wanted us to stay here. And that was why this clinic was constructed. Really, really, really happy, 100% happy for this hospital, you know, because you were happy more. The people in Minnesota, from here to the hospital, where they nearby, we is about seven miles and a half. All people in the strain for good day, something can take, um, pass them, take more to car at the same time. But at the same time, make now up more, we're happy. If sick affect us in self middle night or so, we can able to travel to Alec now, propose self with the and for go to the hospital. So what is don't come for we are a big, big opportunity. So we're really, really, really happy, sir. The new clinic offers daycare treatments. There are extreme machines, instruments with ultrasound, a pharmacy, and special attention for pregnant mothers. On a daily basis, we're going to look at childhood diseases. We we'll talk about malaria, anemia, uh, prevention of, uh, of waterborne diseases, treating of minor conditions, and doing a primary health care services, doing community sensitization, doing community health education, so that most of the diseases that, that are affecting the people could be prevented and thereby rendering a healthy community. We have a food security program in 25 villages. Each of those villages uh, we have provided water, uh, sanitation, food storage, and drying floors. And I can promise that we will try to extend uh, such programs to this area as well. 